Brahmastra Chung bring out the level five. And this level five is so important because, because you bring out, you release your young Shen. That's the primordial spirit, like the, the Daos. This is, this is a mark in the Daoistic uh, cultivation. It's like from there, or you can go into the state of uh, immortal being, right? Oh, okay. so, now, um, a Alex hasn't got to level five yet, and am I am I correct on that? Or just just you, uh, me, and just other people. But Alexander has uh, joined another uh, have another path. Actually, he's going another path. Oh, okay, okay, gotcha. Yeah, but, um, I'm I'm hoping to interview. Oh, so go ahead. There are uh, actually more and more people that come into level five. We are a community and there are about uh, over 30 people at the, uh, right now who develop the Yang Shen. But you, you need to know, I, I was started with level five and end the level five, okay? But never have done level two, three or four. Never have done these levels. Because when you, when you have uh, like, uh, what, uh, what they say? Uh, have done a lot of energy work and spiritual work in past lives. So you, you are maybe uh, have, have more wisdom. So you can jump from level one into level five. Wow. When you build your, when you build your embryo, embryo, the Tao philosophy, mm -hmm. the embryo, and then become the, the infant and then the young Shen. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, 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 essentially, um, the Yang Shen is uh, like, like, well, what, what's the best way to explain what the Yang Shen is? Is it, is it, uh, is it to basically become like an infant again, so to speak? Uh, am I on the right track on that, or it's like your true self? True, okay. Like your true self. You bring out your true self, actually. And this kind of true self mm, develops, get, getting mature through this time, through the cultivation. And then you become actually just this true spirit, just this young Shen. And all the, these kind of ego stuff and identifications and so on blew away, right? Wow. You need, clear, you need to clear your yourself also in this cultivation. Your your uh, sick chi must go out. Your sediments, uh -huh. your emotional stuff and so on must go out. You must clear uh -huh. your, your character and so on. Oh, okay. Um, so uh yeah, that's that's so fascinating. Um so like by reaching level five um so, like uh has your like psychic abilities heightened has your um you know like he, you know i i know you are yeah yeah, yeah. Ha, has your like psychic abilities and stuff like that heightened and stuff or um ha, have you noticed any like you know metaphysical changes within yourself mm, i can say my my inner light becomes brighter very bright so my whole whole body becomes bright actually in meditation and so on oh. and my my energy feeling and yeah it becomes develops at this time so if i have more abilities yeah sure to move energies and also from healing stuff yes definitely but i don't have test a lot of things like i have done some aerokinesis stuff sure I may a little bit telekinesis, but but my way is first actually the to get into this higher consciousness and not mm. to develop many many different kind of psychic skills at the mm -hmm. moment. They mm -hmm. come with time, but my my goal is isn't that's not my goal at the moment. Mm. Um, so, so for, for someone who j would just join, um, uh, heavenly essence, like how long do you think it'll generally take for someone to get to reach level five? Like, do you, do you have like a, uh, general estimate on how, how long it'll take someone to reach level five? Mm, 
Mm. So it depends on, on every person by himself. So mm -hmm. there are many people they, they reach level one at end of level one into two or three months and then go into five. So I know some people, uh, about 20 people who have done this kind of way. Wow. So just give it a try and Master Lee looks for everyone like where he is standing right now. So you can't, sometimes you can't do the same method or the same practice for everyone, right? You need to see, okay, where is this student right now? What he needs right now? And how can I as teacher help him to develop, to get further? Oh, okay. So some can some maybe needs years of, for for this kind of uh, young shen release but the fastest one was i think three days or six days wow when you're ready when you are when you're already then things happen right wow okay so 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 thomas is is yang shen like similar to like you know like a kundalini experience like are, are they similar or are they completely different things no they're, so. they're completely different i don't know what you mean uh, uh with kundalini so, so 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 i mean you know some people it's have not a, just energy is rising up and then oh no it's not just that you build this kind of uh embryo first you build something it's inner alchemy mm -hmm. and the goal of this also is to to um, refresh your ching ching is the the essence right you know about ching, ching ching from ching. i never heard that term before okay, okay there is ching chi and shen these three treasures oh oh, 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 oh oh so so what what westerners would call jing is that what you're referring to yeah ching yes oh, okay gotcha gotcha okay yeah yeah so this this ching energy energy uh goes away through our life and when we have no more ching in our body then the body disappears right <laughs> he, he died so mm -hmm. you need to practice uh these methods to fill up your ching and then refresh your body and also your shen your your mind actually your spirit mm -hmm. and getting health again healthy again and become more and more stable mm.